Hey, ladies and gents, we're here at Hacienda Tacos in Oklahoma City. That's right, we're gonna pop in here. We're gonna check the food out, see what it's all about. Have a delicious anthem beer or two, maybe. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Mm -hmm. And you know what? What? I kind of hope we make a new dad. That would be splendiferous. Let's go see if we can't find ourselves a new dad. Here with uh, Ribby. This is Ruby. Robbie. 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 This is Robbie. 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 We're all part of the beer club. Yeah. Right. We all have a beer. Yeah. My right. friends have builds. I left my card right. at home though. My build hooks. <laughs> Ow. So starting from left, my left to your right. Stage left. Or that could be my right too, right? Yeah. This is my right. <laughs> yeah, that's your right. So we got uh, chicken nachos. Sure. So um, these aren't your regular nachos. Like it's not a big mess of piled high. Um, just over chips nut with nothing on them. Well, you know, you eat the top layer of those chips and then all you got left is chips. So what we have yeah. here are individually built nachos. That's awesome. So each bite has the exact same, one bite has all the bites throughout. So then um, we also have bread and butter and pickled jalapenos that we make here. Ooh, that's I'm, gonna, so, I'm gonna just go ahead and try one of those. You jump in there, yeah. that bread and butter sounds great. We have, uh, we have people that come just for those. Oh wow, a sweet, a sweet, a sweet hot jalapeno. Do you have some in there? Wow. It is spicy though. It is a spicy. It is a little spicy, yeah. And then um, I'm gonna be also have three different kinds of salsas you can have. We have a, a mild, medium, and a hot. Um, then in the middle here we have uh, two tacos in the same thing. They're cool. uh, they're a barbacoa taco. Mm, okay. um, what that is, it's gonna be a smoked brisket. Okay. Um, we smoke our brisket with pecan and hickory, and we put about 12 hours of smoke on those. Uh, each time we smoke a brisket, nice. then it's pulled. Um, so the barbacoa taco, basically, when we make our tacos, we use a six-inch tortilla. Most street taco places use a three-inch uh, three tortilla. Yeah. yeah. See some cheese or something melted in between there. So yes, we have a, it's a northern uh, Mexico cheese called Chihuahua cheese. It comes from the Chihuahua region of Mexico. Especially a quesadilla. Then we put That's the taco. Awesome. We mm. form the taco okay. like that, so it doesn't fall apart. Right. Yeah, that's great. So um, it's it, it, all, it all, pretty much all stays together. Yeah, once those get steamed, they like to fall apart. Those, they do. Those corn they do. They do. Mm. Um, and then so we we put yeah. a little fresh avocado on top of that and drizzle a little uh, sour cream, and then right. top it off with fajita cheese. That looks delightful. So and then the the final thing that uh, we I wanted to highlight today yeah. is a uh, hatch green chili cheeseburger. So as you see. Underneath we have uh, the overflowing hatch green chili. It's mm. got uh, caramelized and uh, fried onions on top. Ooh, awesome. Um, it is hatch green chili season. So the, the, the cool thing about the hatch green chili, it's only, you know, we got about a three month growing period. Yeah. So right now, um, most grocery stores do have the hatch. So it's kind um, of booming right now? It is booming right now. Uh, we're selling a lot of hatch, hatch green chilies. Um, you can put hatch green chilies on, we have them all year round. We, uh, we freeze them, we stock them. Um, and you can put them on any dish. Um, yeah. As, as I understand, you make some salsas and stuff with it as well. We do, we do. We do make our salsas with it. Um, and we do some special salsas from time to time. All you gotta do is ask. Yeah. He's an hour taco dad. That's right, that's I didn't right. I know if you wanted to accept your responsibility, but you're an hour taco dad. Yeah. I can do that, yeah. I can. We got a beer dad and Derek. My boys. My boys. It's our so taco dad. <laughs> you have golden one, but you do have their new. Um, the ombre. The red ombre, yeah. So we do speak Spanish here as well. Okay, that's what's um, up. So I mean, that's what's up. that that helps a little bit. I know. Uh, God knows a little Spanish. Paquito. Paquito. Yeah, that's right. I mean, and we can we can get you in and out of here in less than 15 minutes. Wow, oh, that's great. That's great. So, so great we have call ahead lunch. ordering ordering that's online. We oh. do uh, Postmates and Chow Now. Different options that you have here that you can. Get your food to go, get it here, eat, and your face. Out. That's quick. In your tummy. In your face. And then you can tummy. stay here for three hours and um, we have margaritas and full bar. Yeah. Well, I'm ready to dive in. Yeah. Yeah. Ready to dive Enjoy. Into it. All Enjoy. right. 
All Glad right. you're here. Thank Taco you Dan, much. Robbie, Don't thank you it. so much. Yes, sir. We're excited to taste these and tell uh, tell the folks out there all about these delicious uh, entrees. Can't wait Food. to yeah. taste these flavors from our Pop Pop Taco Dad. Thank you, guys. Let's eat these nachos. Appetizers first is the way to go. In your tummy and then all around your mouth hole. All right, I'm excited. What about you, man? I am. I'm gonna get in this bad boy. Yeah, I've been I'm eyeballing glad, this one. I'm glad that they have these individual chips like this, like they were saying. No, we didn't gotta fight over dry chips. No. We're not fighting over dry chips. We tink it. We don't have to go talk to the manager and ask them to come say if there's a rule. There's a rule in the restaurant. You can't eat the dry chip. You can't eat the chips with all the good stuff on them. That's it. They're pretty hot. That's some business. You wanna try some of this sauce on here? All right, so we told them specifically not to tell us what kind of sauces they were so we could play a game and guess it. Yeah, we won't guess the sauce. That smells like a nice uh, verde sauce. Oh, uh, yeah. What does verde mean? It means green. Is it Spanish for green? It's Spanish for green. My friend would never lie to me. That is a... Uh, Salsa Verde is muy bueno. I can't really put my finger on what this one smells like. I think this is a wonderful appetizer. Mm -hmm. This, this salsa is yeah. really good. You share it with your friends. And like he said, you don't have a fight at the end of the night because of, you know, dry trip. Yeah, when you start off your night with nachos that you fight over, you end up having a bad night the whole night. You want to move on? Let's move on to these tacos. This is the... Um, Babacoa. And then we also got that chihuahua uh, cheese. Ch chihuahua milk. Chihuahua milk in there. Chihuahua cheese milk. Oh, no, that's right. It wasn't made with... Uh, it's not made with real dogs. No, that's just... A, it's a region. It's a region of... In Mexico. 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 Look at that. You're going in for a meat That's that taste. brisket. I want to taste that brisket. I kind of want to do the same. Mmm. Mm. Yeah, you can taste the smoke. The smoked meats here. Hickory Woo. and pecan. Gotta get some cotto in there. You gotta get some cotto. What's that cheese called on top? Something fancy. <laughs> I like food. Uh, I love it. This, this is, a, is a, a rojo. This one's a rojo. Rojo? Means red. How do you, you know? It's just red, I don't know. Oh, colors? Yeah, these are disposable burp curtains. <laughs> <laughs> I know, that's the whole point. All right, so moving on here. All right, this is the Green Hatch uh, burger. Yeah, you wanna do a little burger smooch and then dive in? Yeah, let's try to do a full burger 96. Bam, this is gonna sound stupid. That's okay, I'm, I'm here for you and I support you. And whatever this you're tastes to say. like a burger made at a taco place, for sure. I was just thinking the same thing, but in, in a way that's like, you know, a lot of times like a Mexican restaurant will have like a burger on the menu and... It just tastes like a hamburger. Nah. This tastes like, this has got taco seasoning in the meat. Mm -hmm. So you got like... That's a Mexican you, hamburger. <clears throat> oh man, that is great. The patty is very juicy. That uh, green chili is shining through. Like I can see it right there. It's a half green chili. Here's a house green chili. That's a house green chili. Hatch I'm green chili. so glad I did not just take that to the face. Yeah. I think I'm gonna have to eat this whole half burger. This is really good. I'm getting, I'm making a pants mess. I gotta say the best thing about this burger, all the stuff that falls out of it onto the fries. Look at here, now you have some loaded fries. Okay, I thought I didn't know where you were going with that. I said we were gonna describe the fries and then you just continued to describe the hamburger, so. Well, I was talking about the dish as a whole. Okay, yeah, like you, you definitely came around full circle with that and that's why I appreciate this, this guy. That's why he appreciates me? And if you check on there real close, I got some seasoning on there. I'm gonna bet that's some sort of a Mexican seasoning even. It looks like a cartoon, like bugly eyes and a big uh, goofy uh, witch's nose. We're just a couple of gals gabbing about our witch stuff. You can't come on witch's nose. You're, you're going for it? Yeah, 
trap. It's not that spicy. And it's kind of cold like a popsicle, so it's kind of like a dessert. You can fill this with ice cream. Robbie, okay. Taco Dad. Dad, yeah, can we get some ice cream on our chili, please? Taco Dad, can I get some ice cream on my chili, please? All right, we have uh, thoroughly made ourselves a little bit of a delicious mess here Ooh, at Hacienda boy. Tacos, North May Avenue. Got to thank our brand new Taco Dad, Robbie, for yeah. having us out. I can't believe how many dads we're collecting on this uh, food venture of ours. But the food is great. Yeah, you got some fun twists delicious. on some stuff. Um, you're in a great location. Yeah, right here on North May. Like you can't ask for too much more. You got delicious anthem beers. Yeah, I would highly recommend this to anybody that hasn't tried it yet. And you know, it's great for people that want to try a variety of things. You don't have to, you know, it's not just tacos, y'all. Just yeah. get in here and try Hacienda Tacos. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag Taco Tuesday. Hashtag brand new dad. Hashtag hooray for taco dads. Hashtag burp curtain. Hashtag, hashtag burp curtain. <laughs> Oklahoma. There's so much food to eat in Oklahoma.